<laughs> okay, anyways. Hey everyone, uh, Jade here along with my wife Rose, and we are here with another product review. I actually have another subscription box for you guys. I'm sure you've seen advertisements online for a group called The Candy Club. And uh, they sent me a box to sample for them. I actually don't know if this is going to be a one time review for me or monthly. I will find that out later on. And we we're going to find out. Supposedly it's, I think, three things of candy they talk about. I'm not sure. Okay. So inside is a nice, I guess that's almost like a Tiffany blue type color. Candy Club curated just for you. Stay sweet, the Candy Club team. That's cute. Um, advertisements for all the different social media groups. And then it says, was it Better Candy, Big Ol' Smiles? And it looks like it's in like a, um, what's it called? Th thermal wrap, I guess yes. you call it. So, like in the summer heat, if there's anything chocolate based, which actually, I don't know if they have chocolate based. I've seen mostly like gummy based and hard candies. But it prevents it from, you know, spoiling or melting. Let's see. Candy Club, the Premier Candy of the Month Club. Now, I wonder if this is what they included in it. Gimbals, 41 flavored jelly beans. We, we've actually had Gimbals. So if that's what in here, we're going to be very happy. Uh, Duvall's Wild Cherry Sour Powell Belt. That will probably be more you. Thank you, I've actually started liking sour stuff. And Gimbals Orange and Cream Soft Chews. And let's see, as an added treat, enjoy a splash of sweets, cotton candy, salt water, happy. Yeah, I see the tab. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. That they have the three jars of candy and then around it kind of as a photo is some of the salt water taffy. So, let's see here. Let's pull a couple of those out. Okay, so these would be the sour belts. They see sour candy ribbons. Pretty good size. Now they don't give any idea what weight is. So that I'm not quite sure about, but so that's the sour boats. Pretty generous, like you said. This is where the weight came. When we take this box up, we're like, damn, this thing is heavy for candy. It's the orange cream shoes, which will probably be one of my favorites. And then lastly. The 41 flavor jelly bean absorbent. Oh. There's no kind of, uh, like... No, no cheat sheets. Huh. <laughs> We're used to having things where if you ever bought the gimbals, which is what that brand is in the store, the jar actually has, like, a color-coded sheet. Um, actually, I think Gimbal's website might have it, so if you're yeah. really that curious and, you know, want to know what you're eating, you can always go on their website and... Wow, they give you a lot of those. I expect they're only two or three. <laughs> yeah, no, they give a nice little assortment of the saltwater taffies as a fill -off. Whoops, there's still two more. <laughs> That's almost a whole bag full. Yeah. So yeah, everything came in. Damn. Actually, I hear more. Another, at least one more. Yes, is that everything? Okay. That's a cute box. No, oh, <laughs> damn. <laughs> It's like never ending salt water taffies. That's a lot. It's like a whole bag worth. So yeah, everything comes nice so nothing gets damaged. See how many you get. Basically, that's a whole entire bag that you would get in a grocery store. Yeah, I can't even lift up all the salt water taffies. These are, <laughs> these are quote the bonus item that they send you. So they only guarantee you three containers this size and I would say, I would call them pretty much full. Oh yeah. It's like, yeah, these are literally, but that's because they'll sour strings. Honestly, I've purchased the large thing of the jelly beans in the store and it wouldn't have even filled this up. That's a lot of jelly beans. Yeah, I think, and the big thing of jelly beans was what, like 12 bucks or something like that? Yeah, it wasn't cheap, around $10. And um, if I'm wrong, I will correct this later on, but I believe this club is like maybe $20 a month. So you figure this alone is half of your subscription. Plus it gets you to try things you haven't tried before. Like I've, this is from the same company, Gimbals. Did I say that? Yeah. yeah. No. Yeah. The, these were so same company as the jelly beans I love, but never tried them. Looks interesting. Okay, so which they said these we tried before, these are very good. We would rank these almost up there with jelly belly for about what, almost half the cost. Mm-hmm. And if you look they have like tutti fruity and buttered popcorn. They're pretty much comparable to jelly belly. Right, just a lower 
price point. So, um, so sour try? or sweet? The sweets, okay. I'm gonna try the orange cream chews. They're nicely sealed so they don't pop open in shipping. It's almost like opening a paint can. It's kind of cute. It's like a little, um, reminds me of an old fashioned candy dish. Okay, so I get fed out. You see the thing? I was trying to open the outside. There's actually an inner ring. You pull the inner ring to open. Oh. So the one for you. Thank you. And one for me. You smell the cream. Oh, I like those. Mm hmm. We're very big on gummy candy, so actually I'm very happy with this assortment this month. They're very easy to chew as well. Yeah. I expected them to be harder. You definitely get the cream more than the orange. The orange is kind of like an afterbite. Definitely you, more cream. Yeah, you do get the orange in there, but it's kind of like in the back afterwards. These have the same consistency as um, the gumdrops. Um, like the, the spice drops? No. The no. big ones that I like so much from the grocery store, they have tropical and regular. Dots? Dots. Yes, they're like big, they're like dots. Okay. Now for the sour ribbon. Now we'll probably just share one of these just so we can give you our opinion of them. Works for me. Seems sealed a little bit. Um, hmm. Let's see if I have anything to pop it open with. Probably knowing me, I don't. Okay. Now, I would point out that I like this a lot better than just having a bag of candy sitting around. Because it's sealed. It's and sealed and it keeps all the air out and everything. Okay, guys. I apologize in advance for any stalling. Uh, it is unintentional. I cannot get the thing open. <laughs> yes, the wonders of video. <laughs> Okay, maybe I won't be reviewing these right now. <laughs> uh, ever have one of those days, and that's what it feels like. Um, pardon me for moving in front of the camera, guys. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> yeah, don't do that because then it ain't gonna reseal. Maybe. Not too well. <laughs> oh well. Okay, anyways. Actually, look at these. You know what they remind me of? Damn, besides the fact they're longest. Oh my goodness. <laughs> that is a long strike, but they're kind of ribbed, so it reminds me of that British candy we tried. Was it British? No. Some no, sort of foreign candy we tried recently. Hopefully it's as good as that, because we loved it. Yeah. I think that was one of the first sour candies I had actually liked. Uh, damn, what were they called now? Do you remember? Mm. Duffy... Paco power on these. These are a little bit overly sour for my taste. And she loves sour. These are on the level of like crybaby sour. Almost, yeah. If you're not like really into sour, you're not gonna like these. No. So, so far, two for three. So they said we've had the gimbals before, so I'm not even really bothering opening those because they said they're good, I've had them. And you can see by looking, you know, very wide variety according to 41 flavors. Now, of course, you figure they probably buy them in bulk and they fill them for them to ship out to the box people. So, of course, they can't guarantee that you're going to get all food and flavors in your, in your container, but it's definitely... There's a lot. A lot in there. I'll be completely honest. I don't really care for these. Now, like, my brothers love sour and they would probably like them. So you have to really like sour. Right. And I guess last would be the cotton candy flavored. We both love. Uh, we both love saltwater salt taffies. taffies so. Yeah. One more sip of water to get rid of the sourness. Yeah, I did the same thing. Very soft, which is nice. I don't like hard taffy. Yeah, and we even have the air conditioner on here, so the fact that it's soft even in the quote heat. Well, you know, air conditioning. It's good. Mm-hmm. It's like, yeah, you know, pretty much your generic salt water taffy. I've had other kind of candy brands before, so I don't know the brands to, you know, give you a comparison, but a lot of them are pretty much the same. Now, it says sweets, 
Connie Kane, so I'm guessing this is like their own. Ah, and this is a final thought. One thing that's nice on the back here, on the back of the list of the items they send you, is also a card information of all the nutritional facts. That's nice. Mm -hmm. A lot of people follow their sugar intake and things, so that, that's nice. Including algae warnings. Like they do warn you that these contain wheat. These have no algae warning, so if you have someone who's gluten free, they should be a safe bet. Um, let's see, the creams don't have anything in them, but they are made in a factory that has tree nuts in it. So just a warning on those. And the same thing with the saltwater taffies, no allergens listed, but it is in a factory with peanuts and tree nuts. So that's very good that they include all that, just in case you have anybody in your family that may have an allergy that they need to worry about. So there you have it, the unboxing of the candy club. And it doesn't say for the month, so I don't know if this box was made for June or July, because I was actually supposed to get this a little while back. So sadly, that information I don't have you. I think it's a good deal. Oh yeah. I think just for two of these would cover the cost of the candy. And let's say that you didn't like your third one, you could give it to a friend or someone and just keep the other two. So yeah, so to guarantee you the, the three, I keep forgetting about that one, the three containers for the amount of the cost. And they said, and then you get basically saltwater taffy and I think other goodies basically thrown in as bonuses each month. That's nice. So there you have it. Actually, like I said, like this, if you're someone who works in an office or like a secretary, this would be cute just to sit on your desk. Also, you know what? This is just my opinion. I think these would make a cute little gifts. Yeah. Like three gifts, like you would put this like in a little gift bag mm -hmm. and give it to someone as a gift because it looks almost like a little old-fashioned candy dish. Right. So... So, I would definitely recommend the Candy Club subscription box. I will hopefully have a link below on where you can actually get your first box, and hopefully I will even have a discount off you guys. Thanks again for watching us. Thank you.